Welcome to the iClarify tutorial on how to jailbreak your iPhone 5, iPhone 4S, iPhone 4, and iPhone 3GS using Evasion. This procedure will work for iOS 6.0 through iOS 6.1. Let's begin. Connect your iPhone to the computer and launch iTunes. Select your iPhone from the list of devices. Make sure you are on the Summary tab and click the Backup Now button. Once you've successfully backed up your device, you are ready to restore to iOS 6.1 if you aren't already on it. Create a folder called Ponage on your desktop. Using the text version of this tutorial, you can find download links to the iOS 6.1 firmware for your device. Download the IPSW for your iPhone. Make sure to save it in the Ponage folder on your desktop. Once the download is complete, return to iTunes. Hold down the Shift key and click the Restore iPhone button. Navigate to the Ponage folder on your desktop and select the IPSW we just downloaded. Then click Open. When asked to confirm, click the Restore button. Your iPhone will now be restored to the firmware you selected. This may take some time. Once the restore is complete, return to the text version of this tutorial and use the links to download the latest version of Evasion. Save it to the Ponage folder on the desktop. Extract the Evasion archive to the same Ponage folder, then double-click the extracted folder to open it. Right-click the Evasion executable and choose Run as Administrator from the contextual menu. The Evasion utility will now open. Once it identifies your device, click the Jailbreak button. The app will retrieve information from the device to generate jailbreak data, prepare stage 1 jailbreak data, inject stage 1 jailbreak data, reboot the device, wait for the device to be ready, inject stage 2 jailbreak data, upload Cydia, and upload the Cydia packages list. You will then be asked to unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak app icon. It is imperative that you tap the icon only once. The app will open and immediately close. Evasion will then eject the remount payload, remount the root file system, prepare the final jailbreak data, inject the final jailbreak data, and complete. Your iPhone will reboot a final time, after which you will be jailbroken with Cydia on your springboard. Congratulations, your iPhone is jailbroken.